Hello! In this video, we will discuss the different types of rock compressibility. Rock compressibility is divided into three major types, matrix, bulk, and pore. Matrix compressibility is the fractional change in matrix volume per unit change in pressure. Its equation is shown here, where CM is the matrix compressibility, VM is the matrix volume, and DVM over DP is the change in matrix volume over change in pressure. Since it's difficult for the matrix volume to change with pressure, we usually ignore the matrix compressibility and assume it's to be negligible. Bulk compressibility is a fractional change in bulk volume per unit change of pressure. Its equation is shown here, where CP is the bulk compressibility, VP is the initial bulk volume, and DVB over DP is the change in bulk volume over change in pressure. Bulk compressibility is important for ground subsidence studies, especially in reservoirs close to the surface with rapid production, which causes rapid reduction in fluid pressure. Subsidence is the gradual caving in or sinking of a piece of land which has environmental impacts. Finally, pore compressibility is the fractional change in pore volume per unit change in pressure. Pore compressibility is also known as formation compressibility. The two terms can be used interchangeably and their equation is shown here where CP slash F is the pore slash formation compressibility, VP is the initial pore volume, and DVP over DP is the change in pore volume over change in pressure. Pore slash formation compressibility is important for reservoir performance estimation, as a reduction in the reservoir fluid pressure will lead to a reduction in the pore volume, and thus an increase in the extraction of hydrocarbons. Rock compressibility is not part of either ARCAL or ASCAL. However, it is an important rock property to estimate hydrocarbon production due to compaction. For more information, check out my textbook and booklet on reservoir rock properties, along with my lecture notes, all provided in the description box down below. Thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next video.